we believe the best position to be in is a barbell strategy, but in that barbell strategy, we really like the triple V segment. Um, in addition, certain sectors we like include healthcare and airport bonds. Those are our, our two favorite sectors. And what happened last year with Obama healthcare um, being uncertain, and now we know it's certain, um, we've seen a lot of changes and we've seen a lot of, well, we believe a lot of mergers are going to happen in the not-for-profit space. And that will cause more efficiencies and it will cause uh, more of these systems to have better incomes on the bottom line with these synergies. So we really like the healthcare space. Um, we think the spreads will narrow and I think people feel more comfortable once they understand what the new um, healthcare laws really are going to cause healthcare companies to do. Airports had the same problem as kind of healthcare with the unknown last year. Last year for airports was really the unknown with American Airlines. When they filed for bankruptcy in December of 2011, a lot of, a lot of bondholders didn't know whether landing fees would decrease with American coming out much smaller. But we now know American's going to come out of bankruptcy much larger and much stronger and you're going to see um, those landing fees actually increase. And so people feel much more comfortable with airport bonds, especially where American was really a, a dominant player like Chicago, Dallas, Miami, New York, and LA. When advisors are looking at the community bond space, especially high yield, I think they should really look at the more of a coupon flow. Unlike last year where we had large capital appreciation, we think just the opposite is going to happen this year, where most of your return is going to come from your coupon. There will still be like 20% coming from some price appreciation and trading activity, but the majority of your income is really going to come from your coupon.